All right, Easy Agent Pros. In this article, we are going to discuss how to integrate your lead site with Salesforce. The first thing you're going to want to do is head over to your apps page. Um, hopefully, this is the dashboard and what it looks like if you don't have Google set up. Hopefully, yours looks like you have Google set up with the graphs. Uh, I'm just using a demo site here. That's why it's not set up. You will then go to the bottom, go to Paths. Uh, and from here, what we're going to do is we're going to create a new API setting. Um, that's right here um, up at the top. And we are actually going to click Webhook. Um, and from there, we're just going to save this. And now in our default path, we're going to go in here and edit it. And uh, we are going to add a webhook. And uh, now what we can do is we can get these leads anywhere. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to load up Zapier. You can connect this directly to Salesforce, uh, but it does require some knowledge. So you just need to go to Zapier. Um, they are one of the premier connectors of apps. Um, and you just click the Make a Zap button. Uh, we're going to select the webhook. And we are going to catch a hook. Uh, you don't need to worry about any of that. You're now going to copy this, come over here, paste it, um, and then you just click save. You can, you, at the same time, uh, you, could, you could connect this to anything else. You could send yourself an email. Um, you could send your team an email. You could send a text. Uh, you could hook up any of the other numerous uh, CRM options Lead Sites has. Uh, but I'm just going to pretend like that's all you want to do. Uh, then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to the front end of my site. Um, and I am going to uh, go to our schedule page. Now, my page does look a little different than yours because this is a, a dummy test site right here. Um, and I am going to go to a squeeze page. Let's see if I have any made on this site. Great, I do. Uh, I'm going to go view that. And we're going to fill out a simple dummy lead. Um, so, dummy last... One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, four, testing at gmail.com, schedule. Uh, and now we've passed that lead through, so I'm going to go back to Zapier. Um, okay, and uh, this should fire over here. Let's see, it's looking for the hook, and it got it. Um, so what basically happened is your lead site sent all this data over to the CRM. You can see our full name, you can see our first name, you can see our last name, you can see our phone number, you can see the format of the phone number, um, you can see what page I was on, you can see the email address right here. You can just see, you know, like what type, it was a squeeze lead, um, and all this stuff, right? And here's the message from that schedule page. Obviously, you know, if they fill out something else different. Uh, then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go here to Salesforce, and we're going to create a lead. And you just complete this how you'd want to complete it, um, where you connect an account um, and then uh, set it up and go. So now your leads can go directly from your lead site into Salesforce. And once you're in Salesforce, you can do whatever you'd like to do with them. Uh, if you'd want to send a lead into your lead site and a different CRM, uh, you can actually do that in two different ways. You can, you can come back to the Paths app and hook up, like I said, maybe you want to use MailChimp to send a newsletter. On the default path, you simply come here, um, and you can add MailChimp here. Uh, to do that, you first have to add this, um, then you'll add MailChimp, put your API key there, and you'll be good to go. Um, you also, on this zap right here, you can add another, um, let's say you want to send a message to the, that lead right away. You can actually hook up something like Gmail um, and send a stock email to that person uh, right away and all you have to do is uh, pull in their email and then you can send um, welcome and you can send them an email that way too. So it's a really powerful tool that's why we built it. It's a webhook. You can get it over here and you can send them to Salesforce, send them an email initially um, or you can keep adding to the path and send them to MailChimp. You can actually even once you're in here you can actually add Instead of using the path, you can actually send it to MailChimp this way too. So lots of options, lots of flexibility. Hope you're enjoying lead sites. This is how you use the Salesforce integration.